So I had just finished a video um, explaining how to set up speech recognition on the computer and I was having difficulty at the end um, having it work in Google Drive or I even tried it in Open Office, and neither of them worked. But I found out how um, to make the speech dictation to text work. And all you have to do is go down to your Start button and find WordPad. Now, it took me a little bit to find WordPad. Actually, I'll show you how I found it. So let's see, if you go to All Programs, all programs and you go to accessories I found it right above ease of access so right there wordpad and it opens up a word um, a document for writing and what I can do is now see I have my um, speech recognition toolbar right here and I can turn it on Hi, my name is Stacy Tully, period. Well, you can see it didn't really recognize my speech, so I'll try it again. Hi, my name is Stacy, period. Hi, my name, period. Well, look, it doesn't recognize my name, but it recognized Stacy. Let's try another one. The Roman Empire. That didn't work very well. The Roman Empire. Oh, it's working now. Oh, I'll work now. The Roman Empire. Fairfield. Fairfield. Center. Center, say center, school. So this that's the first time that I was doing this and you can see there's definitely some bugs that you would need to troubleshoot. But I think if you go through the tutorial with um, the students and you have them work on uh, speaking clearly and slowly, this will um, work better and better each time. So now, how do we get this into our Google Drive? You would simply highlight it, Control C, go to your document that this is the document I was working on in the last tutorial, and I'm going to do Control V, and there is my text and I didn't want them to say that word so I can just backspace it now and I can capitalize it the C capitalize the school it's actually good that the kids would have to do some editing um, along with it but look at that the majority of the typing um, which might be a lot of work for a certain student is taken away this is available on an iPad in Google Docs, but some classes don't have the same amount of iPads as another class, and the students are becoming, you know, the one-on-one -on -one with the computer. So this is another tool that we can um, have kids use to help them with their typing and their writing.